Hello everyone, welcome to Charlotte and Zeke. Take a little look at One Night Hot Springs. It's a visual novel game that's very short. We've been we've just read on the Steam reviews. It's very short. I believe it was free or very cheap. It was free. It was free. This, this one was free. Uh, did you read the store page about it at all? Oh, we're going to a hot springs and we have to try and not cause trouble. That's all I read. Okay, cool. <laughs> I read a bit more than that, but I'll leave it as a surprise. Ooh. Ooh. Just so you know, it's not going to be like, as far as I know, it's not going to be like a doki doki literature club situation. <laughs> but what a cute game! Um, who wants to be Harrow? Uh, I'll be Harrow if you want. Sure. <clears throat> who on earth is calling me? Beep. Uh, I'll be... Manami. Ma Manami. Haru, it's been so long since I've talked to you. Sorry for calling so suddenly. You're not busy, are you? Not busy at all. How have you been, Manami? If that was me, I'd be like, I'm really busy, I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 I've been wonderful, thanks, and that's why I wanted to call you, to brag. Oh, my birthday's coming up, and since it's my 20th, my parents said they would let me go on a trip with my friends. So my plan is to go on a trip to the hot springs with my two best friends. And of course that includes you. As number two. Oh. <laughs> my parents will pay for everything, so don't worry about the cost. Hot springs? But you know that I'm... I know, I know, which is why I'm calling you to talk to you first before deciding anything. Harry, you're my oldest and closest friend. Very old. Mm, you're like 40. <laughs> If I look that good at 40, <laughs> it would mean so much to me if you were with me to celebrate my 20th. But also, I want you to enjoy yourself to your fullest. So let me know what I can do to make you as comfortable as possible. But it's been years since I've been to a public bath, let alone a hot spring. I know! Which is why, I'm, which is why it's a good chance. You'll be with me, so if anything or anyone bothers you, you can tell me. I'm not really worried about being uncomfortable. It's more everyone else. That's me in all social situations. <laughs> It'll be fine. No one will pay any attention. They will. <laughs> Haru, nobody cares as much as you think they do. I promise. Please come. For me. What, what should, should I, say? I say? What do you want to say? I mean, I feel like if we say sorry... I think then, the game ends. Yeah, the game's just going to end, so... <laughs> we got to go. Yeah. Fine, if they have reverse, reserved baths, I'll go. Reverse baths. The oh. bath... It, no, no, it's, that's what you said first. Oh. You said reverse and corrected yourself, and I'm just like, everything else is wet. The bath is your only salvation. <laughs> yes, it's going to be the best birthday ever. I'll call you again when everything's been sorted out. Beep. She always hangs up so fast. I can't believe I agreed to go to the hot springs. What should I do? Go to the hot springs. How do women behave when they go to the hot springs together? Boop. Let's see what the search terms hot springs with female friends get me. Don't search that. <laughs> oh, an article titled When Going to the Hot Springs with Your Girlfriends. You don't have to care that much about makeup, so I should worry about it a little. Don't worry about bus size. Well, guess I don't really have a bus to worry about. Cool. But don't forget to shave. Wait, shave? Which parts? How much? Your whole cranium. Your whole head. <laughs> Lose it. <laughs> I just don't know. I'll just have to figure it out as I go. Oh. I'll just wait until Manami calls with more details. This is enough internet for me today. I wish I could do that. <laughs> Back to sleep. Yeah, what time is it? <laughs> I woke up, I answered the phone. Didn't get out of bed, but went back to sleep. <clears throat> I'm really here. Do you wish you gave yourself a less awkward voice to do? No. No, it's just you like... I'm, I'm sort of like still phlegmy from like having a cold. Nice. Hmm. What on earth am I doing? I'm not really prepared for this. But here I am now. I just have to power through this. You can do it, Harry. Look at that determined face. Hmm. Uh, I'm guessing that's me. Harry, over here. Where? We... Oh, that's you oh. still. Hi, Manami. Oh, wow, Haru, I love your hair. Thanks. I decided not to shave it off. <laughs> <laughs> it looks amazing. 
Thanks, Minami. Ooh, Erica. Hey, Minami, don't forget about me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, Erica. This is Haru, my childhood friend. And Haru, this is Erica, my friend from high school. The last name is Nagata, in case you were wondering. I'm Haru Suzuki. It's nice to meet you. You can speak more casually, you know. We're the same age. We're the same age? Yep, we're well, close enough. Erica's 20. Yeah, I heard from Minami that you two went to the same preschool. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah. Wow, you really need to loosen up a bit. A dip in the hot springs will probably do you some good. Minami, you gonna check us in or what? Right, let's go then. <gasps> old woman. Do you wanna be old woman? Sure. Welcome. Uh, oh, yeah, Minami. I'm getting... Because, like, the colours are so um, pastel. Yeah. I'm having a little trouble distinguishing when they pop up. But with these two, it's very distinct. So I, it's all on me. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, I have a reservation and uh, Tachi Banner. Yes, we have your reservation. Would you like to fill out this registration card? Hi, Erica, could you fill out your information? Yeah, sure. Okay. Time to fill out this form. First, my name. Probably need to write my legal name. My legal gender, no, too. No, sorry, I should be saying this. Oh, yeah, sorry. Yeah. I should fill out the rest of the form. Age 19. Dress and occupation. And everything else. I wish I knew what all these say. But at least I saw that bit. <laughs> yeah. I, I had an inkling. Yeah. I'm finished. Woo me. <laughs> me too. Thanks. Here's the registration card. Thank you. Just let me... Hmm. Mr. Haruto Suzuki? I probably need to answer. Uh... I guess is there a problem? That's me, but is there a problem? Oh, you just kind of said both. <laughs> huh. I see. Your room is the Ginko room on the second floor. Ginko. Ginko. I think a Ginko is a slur. Is it? I'm dyslexic. I don't know. Oh, I know you're dyslexic. <laughs> <laughs> so that's why I, I want people to know that you're not being like a jerk. <laughs> Please enjoy your stay. Mm. Let's go to our room then. I'm gonna buy a drink first. My throat is like a dessert. I know that's not what it said. Good. <laughs> See you back at the room. Hello. Oh no, that's you. Yeah, Harry, you okay? <laughs> yep. Don't have to worry about me. Let's go to the room. We <laughs> just sliding away. Wee. Nice. It's a proper tatami room. Nice. Tatami is so much trouble to clean, but I love how it looks. I love tatami too. It is such a nice smell. I just want to lie down and sleep on it. Go ahead. Me and Suzuki here will just head to the hot springs while you're snoozing away. No, don't go without me. I want to go to the hot springs too. It's my birthday. Don't be a <laughs> bitch. Yeah, okay, they're heading to the hot springs ASAP. Ooh. Too much studying hunched over at my desk lately. I need to give my stiff shoulders a break. Hot springs... We should get changed first, I guess? The Yukata should be around here somewhere. I don't know what a Yukata is. It's uh, like the bigger uh, gowns they have. Oh. Not here, or here, or... Oh. Found them. <laughs> oh, they're cute. I wonder if they're for sale. Let's get changed then. I'll change in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> I'll change in the bathroom. What's up with... Oh. What a cute game. Mm. Thank goodness the new cat are unisex. I just hope that it's big enough for me. Oh. Looks like it should fit me fine. You cat are all straight lines, so not having a waste of much of... <clears throat> a waste or much? Or much of a chest, it's better. It's perfect for me. I hope I can tie it well. Oh, that's 
<laughs> that's not a good bow. 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 Let me try again. No, that's fair, actually, because, like, <laughs> bow and bow are spelt the same. It's mm. like wind and wind. Yeah. Run like the wind. Maybe maybe this is a little better. Oh, those things. Yeah. Yes. I'm okay with this. <laughs> Good reaction image. <laughs> Sorry for the wait. Oh, looking pretty good. Thanks. Yeah, if I didn't know any better, I would have thought, uh... Erica, I told you not to say that. It's okay. Harry. It's better than the other possible reaction. Yeah. Let's get going. I need to check the times for the reserved baths. What? You're not heading to the women's baths with us? That would be a bit too, you know. I don't think it'd be that big of a deal. Erica, don't. It's fine. I want to check out the reserved baths anyway. Come on, let's go. Yay. Oh, Harry, Erica and I are going to head in then. You don't have to worry about me. I'll see you again at dinner time. That's what she said. <laughs> Harry, <laughs> let's go already. Ah, I don't grab my arm. Okay, they're gone. Cool. See you. I'm, I know. I'm making Manami worry. I've just got to stop that. <laughs> Look at that little face. <laughs> First, I should find how to reserve the bath. Excuse me. How may I help you? <laughs> how do I reserve the baths? If you mean the family baths, please head to the left and write your name on the room reservation list. Thank you very much. The family baths are to your right. Yes, thank you. She went left. She sure did. <laughs> <laughs> I came here, but is it really okay for someone like me to head into a family bath? Can you can you even use family baths on your own? Yeah, of course. I'd just be taking away a time slot from an actual family. What should I do? Hmm. It's just one time slot. They don't, they don't seem busy. No, they I've, don't. I've seen no one else, and. I feel like if we give up on the family bath, we're just going to force her into the baths that she doesn't want to be in right now. Yeah. So she should do what she's comfortable yeah. with. Yeah, it's just one time slot. Who cares? I guess it should be okay. It would be a shame if I came to a hot springs and didn't actually go in. And it's been so long since I've been in a proper one. I'm going to reserve a time slot. Let's see. Du, du, du. They're all They're booked. booked. Oh, no. <laughs> Are you serious? Here, I was trying so hard to encourage myself. Oh, excuse me. Sorry, I was just leaving. Oh, would you like to book the family baths? Uh, I was going to, but they're all booked. Oh no, I sincerely apologize for the inconvenience. May I suggest you enjoy our splendid women's baths instead? We have vase-shaped bathtubs which you can join privately, like the family baths. If you'd like, I could show you to the baths. No! Something the matter? No, I just... Uh... Hmm... I'm all for being honest. Yeah. Like, she's she's clearly concerned with us. I, I know it's kind of none of her business, but... Yeah, but at the same time, I... Don't... We're not going to get help if we don't ask for help. It's true, but the whole I guess the whole point of the game is to not cause trouble. We're not causing trouble. I know, but you don't know what this person's intentions are when they know the truth. Sure, but like... We can give her an explanation. The truth is... I think that if I go into the women's baths, I might make the other patrons uncomfortable. That's why I wanted to use the family baths. I see. I understand your concerns. However, as it is, you won't be able to enjoy the baths in this wonderful hot spring town. I can't allow that. <laughs> What? <laughs> I can't allow one of our guests to miss out on our fantastic hot springs. No, it's my own problem, sir. No, you came to enjoy the hot springs, so I'll ensure that you can. And she's just going to slam dunk us. <laughs> Would you please tell me your name and room? Uh, it's Hazu. Hazu to Suzuki. I live in... No, I did I live in <laughs> the ginkgo room. In the ginkgo room. That would be Mr. Haruto Suzuki, then. 
Liz would be fine. Yeah, look, she's nice. Okay. Please forgive me now if you please wait here for a moment. Now I'm even causing trouble for the staff. I guess I should just wait. I apologize for the wait. No, there was hardly any wait at all. Oh, with your permission, we would like to upgrade your party to a room with an open air bath. What? Would that be acceptable? What? I don't want to cause any fuss. It's our way of apologizing for the fully booked family baths. We want all of our guests to enjoy our hot springs. It's also a personal wish from a staff member who loves this hot spring town. Will you accept the upgrade? Hi. Is this really okay? Of course. Then, yes please. Oh, she's blushing. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. If you'd like me to accompany you to your room. This game is very sweet. Mm -hmm. This is the Azalea room. I think it looks the same as our other. No, no, it's got, um... Did the other one have um, seats on the floor? I think it just I, had cushions. I don't know. I don't know how to thank you. It was nothing. I hope you enjoy your stay. It's more pink. I know that much. Oh, it's alien -y. She said she would tell Nanami and Nagato about the change in rooms, too. The change in rooms? Is that, is that what you said? I think that's what I said. It sounded like you said changing rooms, <laughs> but change Hello. in and changing. I love that show. Changing rooms. That is a show that hasn't existed for a long time. I didn't think people would be that accommodating. Maybe the world is kinder than I thought it was. Let's check out the open air bath then. I think if you work in a place like a swimming pool or a hot spring or anything where people have to get changed, you have to be accepting of people not fitting into a box and needing yeah. some, and like needing special special um, special accommodation word? special accommodation maybe you know people not being comfortable with certain things you, you, I, th I think people in this scenario would be accepting of it yeah and if not then give them a one star review yeah go on yelp <laughs> <laughs> the view is amazing I don't even want to think about how much it would cost normally it's absolutely gorgeous is it really okay to get an upgrade like this for free <laughs> Stop worrying, Helen. The staff said it was okay, so I'm going to enjoy this. I need to wash first. Oh, I love the smell of the shampoo. Chrysanthemum. Chrysanthemum? It's really relaxing. It's really... I don't know what it is. <laughs> <laughs> and this is a charcoal soap? Cool. Key. Now let's try out the conditioner. Now wash it all off and head into the bath. Oh, that's right, you've got to get clean before you go in the baths. Mm. Oh, wow. I can feel the knots in my muscles loosening. I can't even remember how long it's been since I've soaked in a real hot spring water. I could never afford to go to a place like this myself. And I can't even go into the regular hot springs. All I've got is my bathtub at home. Oh. I wish I could stay in here forever. You'll get all shrivelly. I'm sure you'll become pruned. Like a California raisin. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop. Ah, that was a good soak. I should get dressed. What a wonderful bath. Thank you, staff lady. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> staff lady? <laughs> Wow, time passes pretty quickly. My friends are nowhere to be seen. Manami and Nagato should be back soon. There they are. <laughs> As if a scripted event had appeared. <laughs> hey, Suzuki. I heard from the staff that we were upgraded to a room with an open-air bath. Yes, yeah, because the family baths were all fully booked. Wow, that's so nice of them. The staff didn't want to just tell you to go to the women's baths? Erica. Reply honestly or say nothing. Reply honestly. I'm, I'm a big believer of being honest. Yeah, she did, but when I explained, she was very understanding. <clears throat> Sorry, I was having a drink of my very cold coffee. Whoa, that's really cool of her. Yeah. I was surprised, but really happy. Did you enjoy the hot springs? Yep, it was really nice. Yeah, I've never been to such a proper expensive place before. You should come with us. Ah, uh, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Oh, Haru, I think you've got something in your hair. Whoop. Mm -hmm. Let me get that for you. That's my bow. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even know where it is. You can tell me. But it would be easier if I took it. There, I got it. Thanks. 
Hmm, is that how it is? Is what how it is? Nothing, nothing. Mm, sorry, Erica, you're third wheeling. Get oh out. my god. Why is Dinner <laughs> getting here? Oh my god, just one. Just a. Yeah. Oh, I guess that's the door. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, staff lady. Good evening. Please allow me to set the table for you. What would you like to drink? What do you two want? Uh, How about beer for everyone? I, I'm underage, so I'll just have oolong tea. Right, right. Two beers and one oolong tea, please. Please enjoy your meal. <gasps> Manami, are you okay with beer? Oh, Manami, oh. are you okay with beer? I've never actually drunk before. Ever. Any liquid. No. Of any description. Just suck it in from my skin. It'll be fine. It's your twelve. It's your 20th birthday, so you should try and try a bit at least. If you don't like it, I'll drink it for you. More importantly, this dinner. This looks... Amazing. It looks like a table. <laughs> amazing, the craftsmanship <laughs> on this meal. Oh, there we go. Oh, that is nice. I requested a tofu nabe so we can all share. Don't worry, Erica, it's all vegetarian. Oh. Oh, you're vegetarian, Nagato? So am I. Yeah, so it's really tough eating out. It must be really hard to be vegetarian in Japan. Yeah. You can't even get a salad without worrying about it having animal products inside. Animal really? products means you're vegan. Really? <laughs> Isn't it just vegetables? Haha, <laughs> you'd be surprised. There's stuff like bacon and gelatin sometimes. Uh, those... Yeah, vegetarians yeah. can't have those. Yeah, Minami bought me a potato salad with gelatin and bacon before. But I know better now. Anyway, the drinks are here. We should toast. You're the birthday girl, so go ahead. Okay then. Thank you for celebrating my birthday with me. It means a lot to me to have my two best friends here. A toast to my friends. Yay. Cheers. Uh, cheers. <laughs> now that we've got that over with. Let's eat. Let's eat. <laughs> <laughs> oh. This tempura matake is so crispy. Oh man, this tofu is so soft. Tastes even better with a bit of the pink salt. Pink Ooh. salt is great. We've got um, Himalayan pink salt lamps, and they're just big salty rock. I've licked them. It's true. <laughs> we both have. And then I made my parents lick them, and my brother. Don't lick them, they're gross. Don't lick ours, we've licked them. <laughs> but also, the salt would kill all the germs. Anyway, we had to drill air holes into one of them because the candle was going out, so we just had this little tub of pink salt that was fresh. And it was really good. Mm. That was delicious. I'm so full. Of course you are. How many bowls of rice was that? Fifty. Whoa. <laughs> I'm at my limit, too. You two are idiots. This is what it is to go even <laughs> further beyond. Haru isn't an idiot. Neither is Minami. Idiots. <laughs> my body feels really heavy. That's all the rice you ate. <laughs> ah, she fell asleep. Suzuki, can you help me carry her to the futon? Ah, okay. I'll just leave her. <laughs> you don't know what sort of position she's in. She might end with a stiff neck. Uh, yeah, probably. The alcohol probably didn't help. Mm. She's surprisingly heavy. Because she does sports, it's the muscle. It's the 50 bowls of rice. No, that was you. That was me. <laughs> really? I didn't know that. Though I can imagine it. She's always so full of energy. She went out like a light today, though. I think it was the beer. Same. Yeah, trust Manami to be such a lightweight. She's she never drunk before. Yeah, it's a good opportunity for me, though. Good, a good opportunity? I wanted to talk with you. But Manami was being all overly sensitive about it. So I figured I'd ask when Manami wasn't around. I'm not great with this sort of thing, to be honest. But I really just want to understand a bit better. And you can tell me to stop at any time if you don't want to talk, so... Mind if we shout for a bit? Nagato is Minami's friend. I'm sure she really does have good intentions. But I haven't really properly talked to this about anyone before. Um, she's being nice enough. Yeah. B, what are you doing? Our dog's flapping around in the background. What do you want to talk about? You don't have to get so prickly. I'm just a bit curious since you're the first transgender person I've ever met. That might not be true. Huh? You might have met other transgender people before, but you just didn't notice. Maybe. 
To be honest, if Manami hadn't told me, I wouldn't have known. Can I just call you Haru? You can call me Erika. I don't mind. Haru then. Is that like your transgender name? Is that like your superhero name? <laughs> uh, no, it's a nickname from when I was a kid. Oh, so a nickname from when you were still a guy? Ah. Uh, mm. Like, that's being a bit harsh with her. Yeah. But... But honest. Harsh but honest, and that is honest without scolding her. I, I think you got to put her in her place. Yeah. I, I think you like, got to let her know that I wasn't a guy before. Yeah, she wants to learn, so... <laughs> it's not like I was a guy before. I've always been a girl. It's just my appearance doesn't completely match who I am. Sorry, I shouldn't have phased it that phased phrased it that way. What was your name again? I heard it in check-in. Haruto, right? You probably shouldn't ask that sort of thing to a trans to chan, transgender people. <laughs> that is a tongue twister for you. I know. Why? Asking for a name someone isn't using now is kind of denying who they are now. So. Oh, sorry about that. I didn't mean it that way. So could you forget it? It's okay. I actually like the name, Halu. It's unisex. Most names in Japan are unisex, aren't they? No, they're still gendered. Because, um, there's names... I remember, like, you know, reading, like, manga and watching anime and stuff, and being like... Sorry? Let the dog out the room? <laughs> I remember being like, you know, oh, I think that's a female name, and then being surprised when I saw male characters with it. Oh, um, some, some are unisex, some are male and female. It's like, um, you know... Well, it's, it's like here. Well, um, you know, we're uh, free. Yeah. All the main guys in that have female names. Oh. And, like, you know, uh, the show makes fun of it for that. Right. Okay, and, cool. Uh, what is it? Ichigo from Bleach. Ich yeah. Ichigo is typically a female name. That's one of the examples that I was thinking of, actually, but I couldn't remember it off the top of my head. Hmm. Okay, uh, let's carry on. Okay. B. No, go away. What are you doing, B? You're, you're a dog and we don't want you here. Bee, do you want to come out? Come up? on, then. Come on, come have a cuddle. Come join in the story. Oh, the dog's here to headbutt the mic and have a cuddle. Oh, don't headbutt the mic. She will. She always does. Okay, stay. Okay, dog on the lap. Game can resume. I'd like to change my legal name to Heather if I can. Oh, I guess since you haven't changed your name, you can't use Haru on official documents and stuff. Yep. I guess your legal gender is still... Yep. Must be hard on you. Can't you change it? It's a bit tough. I would need to get a gender affirmation surgery and be sterilised. Really? Wow. Is that really what it's like in Japan? That's harsh. What? I mean, I guess gender... Aff I guess gender affirmation surgery is cool if you want to change your body anyway. But you need to be sterilised? Yeah, though in some other countries you can just change your gender without doing either. Yeah, that... I've never heard yeah, about that before. Yeah, that's fucking harsh. Yeah, there are a lot of requirements. You also have to be above 20, not married currently, and have no kids who are minors. Wow. Wait, why do you have to be unmarried and not have kids? Well, for mar... <clears throat> for marriage... For the marriage bit, because if you change your gender, it'll become a same-sex marriage. And that's illegal in Japan. And for the children bit, apparently it would be confusing for them or something. What the hell? The dog is gone. She's being yeah. a pain in the ass. <laughs> I know. I didn't make the law. Uh, just enforce it. Don't enforce it. No, don't enforce that. <laughs> it might get better, though. Some wards allow same-sex partnerships now, after all. I didn't realise it was so bad. I'm sorry for asking you so many questions. I hope I didn't make you uncomfortable. What should I say? Um... It's tell, tell her it's okay. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I don't think we feel better for getting stuff off our chest, but we're happy. To... Yeah, she wanted to be informed. It's okay. I'm used to it. Sorry, I just asked because I was curious. I didn't really think too much about it. It's fine. Okay, I think that after I made you spill out all of that, I definitely owe you one. Huh? I talked to one of the attendants earlier. Apparently, while their official stance is that you should enter the baths, baths for your legal gender. This is a question they're actually asked quite often, and they've decided that it was unofficially okay as long as you didn't bother other guests. There aren't too many guests today since it's a weekday, and she said the bath would probably be empty around midnight. So, 
So nobody would have a problem if you went to the women's bath, you dingus. <laughs> I can't just go in. Calm down, it'll be fine. But what if somebody's there? The baths are big, we'll just keep away from them. But what if they look? They won't look, and even if they do, who cares? If anybody says anything, I'll beat them up. Good. Please don't beat them up. <laughs> Please don't beat them up. <laughs> It'll be fine. They'll be beaten up and bleeding, and the bath water will turn red, and then we'll bathe in the blood of our enemies, literally and figuratively. That sounds cool. But, but, you were drinking earlier. It's why I'm so much stronger. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Haru, don't you want to enter the women's baths? You're a woman too, you have the right. Erica, what should I do? You only live once. Hmm, I'll go. But if anything happens... It'll be fine. Let's grab our towels and go. Wait. Come on. You can't leave Manami there, unconscious by herself. <laughs> Puking and suffocating on it, because <laughs> she's laying on her back. Actually, uh, I think I'll... Come on, you've made it all the way here already. I'll even check to make sure nobody else is inside. Wee. 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 All the keys are in the lockers. Nobody's in the hot springs. Come with me? Okay. Don't worry, I'll change over here. I won't look or anything. Thanks. You can head in first to wash. I'll see you later then. Yay. Wow. It's so nice in here. The water feels smoother than the one in the room somehow. <laughs> Do you think they just came out of the water? Because like, <laughs> it's got a lot of minerals that are good for your skin. What do you think? Pretty good, right? Yeah. Thanks for bringing me. I don't see what the big deal is. I don't understand why you didn't just come to the bath with Manami and me. You don't get it. What don't I get? It. it. Mm. Uh, let's pretend for a moment that you're in. Let's pretend for a moment that you're in. I think everyone gets gym class. Yeah. Oh. Gym class uh, and glitched out. Oh, both, yeah. Huh. Gym class in high school. In gym class in high school. You need to change into your gym uniform. Girls change in the changing room, boys change in the classroom. Where do you change? I'd go to the changing room with the rest of the girls. Of course you would. But what if one of the boys tried to come with you? We'd probably call him a pervert. But I mean, you look like a girl, Harry. But I'm not. At least, not physically. Not completely. And a lot of people aren't as lucky with their appearance as me. This isn't just pretend, is it? You're speaking from experience, aren't you? People like you know exactly where you belong. But people like me don't belong anywhere. We can't just enter bathrooms or changing rooms or hot springs. If I went into the men's bathroom like this and was seen, I'd be told I was in the wrong washroom. But society tells me I can't use the women's bathroom either. It's the same for hot springs, so we have to watch out for ourselves, since nobody else will. Even though we just want to live like everyone else. Must have been really tough for you in high school. My school wouldn't allow boys to wear anything but the male uniform. But I didn't... I didn't act like how they thought a boy should act. I got called a lot of names because of that. Oh. <laughs> yeah, high school students can be vicious. I was at an all-girls school, but things got pretty bad sometimes. Manami never said anything like that. Yeah, well, she's Manami. Nothing bad ever happens around her. But I was a bit of a delinquent. I used to drink beer and fight people in hot springs. <laughs> bit of a delinquent? Wearing my uniform wrong, fighting with bullies, smoking in the toilets. <laughs> you know, the usual. Uh, I don't know how usual that is. Well, I've got over that rebellious <laughs> phase now. But I know kids can be pretty awful. Girls bullying isn't as obvious as cuts and bruises, but it sticks with you. You were bullied too? It wasn't that bad. I didn't fit in. My Nami was pretty much my only friend in high school, and we weren't even in the same class. My homeroom teacher said it was my fault for not trying to be nice, so I just stopped caring. That's awful. Right? But that's just how things are in high school. The people who don't fit in will never fit in. So it's better to just stop caring and enjoy yourself. And smoke in the toilets and fight the teachers to the death with... A toilet paper tube. That'd take a while to kill It, it would, yeah. It'd be brutal. Yeah. We... Sorry for that incredibly depressing speech. No, no. I'm really happy you shared that with me. I don't know why, but I feel like somebody's lifted the weight off my shoulders. 
Well, I'm glad I talked to you. Have you ever told Manami any of this? No. I could never tell her. She's done so much for me. It would just make her sad if she knew. Oh, wait. I'm sure of this now. You like Manami, don't you? <laughs> yeah. There we go. <laughs> you know that she's... You know, right? Yeah, I know. She talks about her boyfriend a lot. Oh. Mm. He sounds like a really nice guy. She could be bi, though. You never know. Well, I, th I don't think that's the problem. I think the problem <laughs> is that she's with someone else. <laughs> oh, I'm bi, so I can be a um, an adulteress. Well, still got a chance. You don't understand. Yeah, yeah. You know, I don't think there's any problem with that, okay? I dated a girl before, too. Oh, my God. Really? Yeah, back when I was in high school, I dated someone at my part-time job. So you're bi then? Bi? Yeah, you like both men and women? Maybe. To be honest, I don't really know if I care so much for labels. But it's cool. You do you. Want to check out another bath? They've got a nice hot one in cypress wood. Ooh, sure. They're gonna hook up. They're gonna fuck. It's kind of cute how you hide your chest with your towel, by the way. I thought you said you wouldn't look. Sorry, I didn't mean to. You do look cute. Okay, I'm heading into one of those vase tubs by myself. Oh, come on. Oh my god, they gonna diddle. Ah, oh, that was great. Hot springs are the best at night when it's quiet. Yeah, thank you for bringing me. Like I said, it's not a big deal. I'm gonna grab a drink, what do you want? Oh, it's okay, I'm fine. Then I'll choose for you. Wait here for a bit. Don't get me a beer. <laughs> She's gonna get you a beer. Eric, it's interesting, but nice. I guess I should wait here. Oh, good evening. It was Miss Suzuki, yes? Did you perhaps have a chance to enjoy the women's baths? <clears throat> no! Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, she yes. went to all the effort of setting it up for us. So, but the. What's. What, the, the, the. Yeah, she's but, saying that. Sorry, I skipped over that. Yeah, but it wasn't the one that. I wasn't the one that checked. My friend looked at the changing room for me. Ah, okay. So she was trying to make sure that she didn't think she was, like, peeping or something. Ah, okay. Ah, yes, the baths are usually empty at this hour. It isn't uncommon for people who want to bathe alone to use the baths at this time. Very pleased to hear that you can enjoy the baths. I hope you have a pleasant night. Huh. She, she knows, knows doesn't, doesn't she? she? But she didn't say anything. She's pretty much... She's pretty much said it was okay for me to go into the women's baths. I'm really happy. Aw. Oh. Hey, got you some herb tea. Oh, I was sure she was going to get us hammered. Thanks. It tastes good. Right? I like beer. You're done drinking that. Let's head back to our room. Okay. And fuck. <laughs> okay, I'm tired as hell, so I'll see you in the morning. Night. Good night. I should get to sleep too. I think I'll have good dreams tonight. Aw. Oh. I've been having messed up dreams lately. I won't talk about them now because it's not the time no. for it, but they've been messed up, right? It's morning. Could you tell? Yeah. Oh, look who finally decided to wake up, sleeping in the same clothes that they wore all day and... Huh? What time do you think it is? Time for breakfast? Breakfast was over ages ago. It's almost time to check out. What? I need to change. Calm down. Manami is dealing with that, so you still have some time. Oh. Is he... I, I cause trouble for Manami again. Hey. Do you have, like, the world's lowest sense of self-worth or something? Huh? Yeah. You cause trouble for Manami again? Are you kidding me? She just went to go check out. What part of that is trouble? She's your best friend, right? Do you think of helping her out as trouble? Of course not. Exactly. It's the same for Manami, you stupid bitch. Kiss me. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, hurry up and get dressed. Manami's waiting in the lobby. Yay. Hi, I just finished checking this out. Oh, thanks, Manami. It's nothing. Oh, and also, I just got a message from my boyfriend. He says he wants to treat all of us to lunch. Mm -hmm. He wants to meet you two. Oh, that's wonderful. Manami, I'd love to. Actually, I was going to take Haru on a tour around the town after this. Sorry. Really? That was me. Oh, sorry. What? You know, since Haru didn't get to go into the women's baths. I just felt really bad for her, so I thought I'd take her out for a bit. Then I'll go too. No, no, no. Go meet your boyfriend. It's your birthday weekend. I'm sure he's got something planned for you. But... Harry, will you be okay? What? Me? I'll be fine. I'll be fine. We're gonna burn down. Yeah. <laughs> Say hi to your boyfriend for us. Okay then. 
Makes me happy to see you two getting along. Take good care of Harry for me, Erica. I'll head out first. See you. See ya. So, we're taking a tour around town? Nah, I just figured that you wouldn't want to meet up with Minami's boyfriend. But if I didn't say anything, you would have just agreed, right? Probably. Hopeless. <laughs> anyway, I do actually want to take a look around town. Not sure where to go, though. Oh, good morning, Mr. Gadda, yes? The lady who upgraded our room. Thank you very much for yesterday. It was nothing. If you plan to visit the town, may I suggest the hot spring in this flyer? Oh. They have lovely private baths here that can be reserved by anyone. My older sister often goes there. Your older sister? Yeah, she also finds it hard going into the women's baths when there are many people about. Oh, your sister is also. Yes, so I just wanted to say, I hope you have a wonderful time here at the hot springs. Forgive my intrusion. Wow, that was pretty cool. Yeah. Guess we should take the lady's advice. Want to check out the reserved baths? Yeah, that'd be nice. Let's go. I'm going to spend like two whole days just bathing. Yeah. There's going to be prunes. Oh, we got an ending. The world oh. can be kind too. Yeah, it's ending Erica end too, apparently. Hey. So this game has multiple endings I saw on Steam. Oh, okay. It's got like seven endings or something. And that's one of them. Can we be a home wrecker? I bet we can be a home wrecker. <laughs> and I'm guarantee you the game just ends if we just say, nah, I'm I'm, I'm not going to Oh the yeah. <laughs> no, let, let's do that now. Erica N2. Oh, it's just that. Yeah. You wanna just Yeah, just bl blast through it quickly, see if we can get another ending. Okay, uh Oh yeah. Yeah. Sorry, I just Sorry, I, I just I can't. just can't. Sorry. It's okay, I understand. I'll think of a different plan for my birthday. No, you don't you don't have to. I'll call you again once I've decided. She hung up. My name is the same as usual. I'm glad she's doing well. But she's wrong. She says nobody cares as much as I think they do, but that's because she thinks everyone's a good person just like her. She's never had anything happen to prove her otherwise. Parents are the best, always understanding, even about me. Her mom even took me shopping for new clothes after I came out to her. They've always been so kind to me with Manami's birthday trip too. I bet Manami really wanted to go to the hot springs. Maybe I shouldn't have said no. I could have just stayed out of the baths. I guess it's too late now. I'll just wait for Manami to contact me again. Normal then. <laughs> Let's try something else. Knew it. Knew it. <laughs> Thank you for playing. Anyway, <laughs> if you'd like to try and find some of the other endings yourself, One Night Hot Springs. It's very cute. I adore yeah. the art in this. I, I really like the game. Mm. Like, I'm not a visual novel sort of person, but I like it when they got a good message to it. Yeah. It's just, it's just very sweet. Like, I'm sure it can be a bit harsher if you do the other routes, but I think... Yeah, we, we picked a nice route by we, accident. We, we picked... We picked the kindnesses that we would expect others to give to us and other people, like... Yeah. People are people. So, like... And uh, so something that's very interesting as well is, like, I won't name names, but I've had... You know, I've got a couple of friends who are transgender who have recently had the issue of going to swimming pools and stuff, mm. and having to buy outfits and stuff that... Well, like, they've wanted to buy outfits that, like, you know, hide their junk and stuff, so... Yeah. You know, just so they can go and not... Not, like, worry and... Yeah, and it's incredibly stressful having to go to um, a pool when, you know, there's other people there you think are going to judge you. Mm. Um, I don't know if there's many of these, but from this I've learned that there are events and things where, you know, local LGBT plus groups will come together and they'll, like, book a pool for an afternoon or something so everyone can get changed comfortably. And I think that's a really sweet yeah, that, idea. Yeah, that's really cool. You know, until until everyone just accepts that... People he, are pe different. People and... are people, and it doesn't matter who they are. Like, until people accept that, it's nice that people are looking for solutions to the problem, at least in some capacity. Yeah. Anyway. you got to support each other, because the world's hard. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> this has been One Night Hot Springs. I highly encourage people to check it out. It's a game by NPCKC. I'm going to see if they have a Twitter. 
Okay. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, and goodbye. Bye-bye.